Tom, let the bells ring five times the bridesmaid. You are now the British Touring Car Champion. And I can tell how much of a, an emotional moment this is for you, Tom. <laughs> it's, um, I, I, I cannot, I... <laughs> I've, and breathe. Yeah. <laughs> I've thought about this moment for literally my entire life. Um, but this is what I wanted to do, this is what I wanted to win. And um, never did I think I was, it was going to come, I'll be honest. We've had a few years of, of coming into this weekend and it, and it not quite working out. I, I, I cannot put into words what a fantastic team I have around me to have, to have made this happen. It is, it is just uh, incredible, you know, from, from Chris and Leslie to, to, to everyone associated with Bristol Street Motors, to Anthony, to Justina, who's not very well, to my amazing girlfriend, Laura, to my parents, to every single person who's helped me along the way. I cannot put into words just how much it means. And the tension of that race. I mean, I, it was unbearable for me watching it. So what was it like for you in the car? Uh, horrible. <laughs> I, I said to David, I felt like I needed, I needed an adult with me. I just wanted somebody just to come in the passenger seat with him and go, it's OK, just chill. It will all be fine. And, um, you know, I, I, I could see that, you know, I was talking to Spencer. Spencer was constant all the way through on the radio, every lap, every lap, more information, more information, knowing what was going on, knowing the gaps, knowing who was around me. But it's just fantastic, honestly. And still, even towards the end of the race, you, you were taking, you were taking, you were racing, you were going for it. I'm not going to do anything else. <laughs> Why would I do anything else? It's a racing car. It's in, in the best championship in the entire world. Why would I sit there? You've got to go for it. <laughs> it's going to take a while for this to, to sort of sink in, but are you able to find some words at the moment just to sum up the magnitude of this achievement for you? No, I think it's the honest answer because when, you, when, you've, when you've devoted, um, when we've devoted our life to it as, as we have done, and you have all the sacrifices, you know, everything from, from you know, starting out, meeting Matt Neal when I was five years old at the Autosport Show, falling in love with the British Touring Car Championship, and over the years, coming through all the support series, all the Janettas, getting into touring cars with Speedworks, it's been amazing, absolutely amazing. And I owe absolutely everything to my amazing team who have, who have put it behind me because they've just worked tirelessly this year. Um, and it's just been incredible, really, really incredible. And as, as you say, this isn't going to sink in. I'm going to have the... The, I'm going to have sore cheeks for at least a week and probably quite a few hangovers as well. Well, I was going to say that it's going to be the biggest hangover. A man here wants to uh, give something oh! to you. <laughs> oh, how lovely. Well done. Oh, Ash, Ash. I mean, you know what this feeling's like. I mean, you know how big this moment is for Tom, don't you? Yeah, it's mega. It's, um, he's a bit... To be fair, these guys and girls have turned up with a package that we couldn't beat, so fair play to them. Thank you. Say, so, make a job. Thank you, Cheers, mate. Okay, listen, I will let you go and collect your thoughts a little bit because we've got more chatting to do with, uh, with Steve and Tim and Paul. So uh, let me just turn around and have a quick word with uh, another man wearing an Accelerate race suit. <laughs> Our race winner. I mean, what a day for the team, but what a race for you as well. Yeah, firstly, massive congratulations to Tom. Um, you know, I'm emotional. I was tearing up even then when he was hugging his dad. It was amazing. He deserves it. He's an awesome driver. The effort he puts in, I raced against Tom in karting, and I know the commitment the family's made over so many years. So massive congrats to Tom. And, um, yeah, I don't suppose anyone saw me at the front then. But Occasionally. Front, yeah, it wasn't easy. I was all over the place. Put it, dropped it a few times, and Josh was catching me, but held on. And um, after such a crazy um, nightmare of a year, it's an amazing way to finish. And have some positivity going into the winter, working hard and getting back on that grid next year. So, um, yeah, thanks to the team and thanks to all my sponsors, 24-7 Blinds and Abraxa Abrasives and Bristol Street Motors. And, yeah, thank you. Well, thank you for all the entertainment you've given us as well. And uh, we, fingers firmly crossed, we'll see you back here next year. It's in crashing, yeah. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to say that. Entertainment as well.